time for new studies. Althea Smith. Althea, back to school, back to school, says the word of the Lord. Lonnie Smith. Lonnie, the word of the Lord for you is that new transportation is coming into your life. Pearl Smith. Pearl, the word of the Lord for you is that new resources and help with children. Rosetta Smith. Rosetta, the word of the Lord for you is that God is healing, um, healing a loved one in your life. Russell Smith. Russell, the word of the Lord for you is that um, don't, uh, don't say no to this new opportunity that's going to come, uh, come your way and be presented to you. Theron Smith. Theron, I hear the word of the Lord for you is that God is giving you a new standing and a new perception. Michelle Smith Daly. Michelle Smith, I hear the word of the Lord for you saying is that God is causing you in this season to make new partnerships in your life. Tammy Soster. Tammy, the word of the Lord for you is that God is um, causing a new strength to come into your body, says the word of the Lord. Francis Speed. Francis, I hear the word of the Lord for you saying travel, travel, travel. Alton Spite. Alton, the word of the Lord for you in this season is that God is going to cause new connections and partnerships to come into your life. Sinceria Spencer. Sinceria, the word of the Lord for you is that um, a, this, uh, a diet change and a weight loss, says the word of the Lord. Sonia Spencer. Sonia Spencer, I hear the word of the Lord for you is that God is going to cause um, some children in your life to re be relocated in their schooling. Alvisha Stanley. Alvisha, I hear the word of the Lord for you saying that God said to take that vehicle in for an inspection. Diana Stegner. Diana, the word of the Lord for you is that God is going to cause you to step back and look at a picture uh, on, on a broader scale, says the word of the Lord. Ernestine Stewart. Ernestine, the word of the Lord for you is that God is going to strengthen your right hand so there's some power and authority that's coming into your life. Amen. Okay, um, I have a Michael Stith. Um, the word of the Lord will say unto you, great courage and a winning smile. Brenda Stocker, the word of the Lord will say unto you, get away from negative thinking. Rodney Sutton, the word of the Lord will say, you'll do well in computers. James Swift, God says, you're a creative genius, use your intellect. Aretha Taylor, God says, you are anxious about a lot of things, God, but God's going to help you with financial matters. Clarence Taylor, you have a heart for children. Walter Taylor, um, the Lord says that you're going to pioneer some things and going to definitely be an entrepreneur. Vanessa Thickpen, stop worrying, stop worrying and be at peace in your mind. Um, Teresa Thomas, this is a season for laughter and joy again. Maggie Thompson, the word of the Lord will say you're going to pioneer and preach and speak the word. Rosalind Thompson, the word of the Lord says travel is in your life. Lily Thornton, this is a season for you to begin to be firm in what it is I've given you to do. Timothy Trent, get ready to prophesy from another realm. Leon Turnbow, the word of the Lord will say move away from worry and real estate is going to be with you. Melissa Veal, the Lord says, no shortcuts, but you got to do everything by the book. Sandra Verser, the word of the Lord will say unto you, your restlessness is going to bring you to peace. Patricia Vincent, the Lord says, get ready to educate and write. Keith Walker, you got music down in your bones. Use it and speak the word. Ernestine Walks, you, have, you are going to come forth in leadership ability, and you stand head and shoulders above your peers. Tawana Ward, this is a season for you to get excitement about the doors God's walking you through. David Warren, patience, and you're going to participate in a new economy in God. Renee Warren, use your creative ability and your talents coming forth. Cynthia Washington, this is a season that you're going to do well with groups of people. Laura Welsh, stop worrying over money matters and you're going to see God's hand. Deborah Wesley, it's a season to let go of negative thinking. Um, Altamese White, this is a season where you're going to pioneer some things and you're going to escape situations that are tragedies. Gladys White, this is going to be a season of structure and organization and management. Charmaine Williams, this is going to be a season of harmony and people you're going to work with. Prophet Kelly, I have a Darmel Williams. Yes, I hear the word of the Lord said that the way up is down. And as you begin to humble yourself, you'll begin to see God exalt you. Janesta Williams. Yes, I see you fa having favor on your job. There's great favor to coming toward you in your job situation. Um, Brother Jesse Williams. Uh, Brother Jesse, the Lord tells me that you're an artist. You, you do well with drawing paintings and people. And I see you're um, 
works being exposed in this season. Katrina Williams. Katrina, in this season, the Lord says that you're in for a treat. God is moving you forward in some things. There's some great things that are happening for you. Don't miss opportunities. Morty Williams. God says he's opening eyes that seem to have been blind. He's opened up that you might see what God has placed right before you, and you're getting ready to move forth. I even see you moving forth in the area of real estate. There's some things going on, and you really need to sow a seed to, um, to just kind of solidify this deal that's coming up. You need to do that. Quayana Williams. Quayana, in this season, I hear the Lord saying that there's some studies. God is moving in the area of your studies and books and things. And God says, don't worry about the finances because he's taking care of that. Sharon Williams. Sharon, this season, I see the Lord expanding some things around you. There's great expansion going on, not only around you, but there's expansion going on on the inside of you. Willie Ruth Williams. Willie, in this season, God is dealing with areas of the heart, issues of the heart, issues of relationship and heart. God says that he's moving in those areas for you. Bobby Williamson. Bobby, in this season, the Lord says that he's given you a great mind and you are to go forward and use this for the glory of God. Mashawn Willis. Will. Um, yeah, Willis. Yes. In this season, the Lord said that he's given you, um, there are great things that are coming towards you. And God says, just don't get in the way of the things that come towards you. Accept them and receive them, says the Spirit of the Lord. Anna Wilson. And in this season, God says that he's tuning you up in this season. He's moving you forward. And there's some things that are coming to you that you're going to be able to unlock and be able to use. Okay. Prophet Wright, we have a Bridget Wilson. Bridget, the word of the Lord for you is new income. Joan Wilson. Joan, the word of the Lord for you in this season that God is causing you to get your mind back. Peace. Ruth Wilson. Ruth, the word of the Lord for you is that God said, don't take no for an answer. Go back to the dealership. Katie Wilson. Winston. Katie, the word of the Lord for you is that God is expanding your space, your living space. You're about to move. Evelina Woods. Evelina, the word of the Lord for you in this season is that God has said healing to your body. Helen Younger. Helen, the word of the Lord for you is that I've seen you opening up the books, going into deeper study. Lekendrick Zips. Lekendrick, the word of the Lord for you is that try something new. I'm seeing you looking for property, but the Lord said look more towards the West. Amen. This is powerful. And I want you to know that this is the Master Prophet Ebron R. Jordan. Thank you for being with us. By this time you have gotten your prophetic word, please use that envelope and send back an offering to help keep the power of prophecy on the air and coming into the homes of thousands of people every day. And remember these words, that destiny is not left up to chance, but it is a matter of choice. Stay tuned as we're going to go now into the live streaming and visit the chat room. And if you're watching us on streaming, amen, live, go now into the stream, the faith chat. Hit faith chat right there on your left. And just say, Master Prophet, I am here. And you'll see me there. And I'll be there as Mar Elijah. Stay tuned and don't go away. Budget that night. That's the way it works. That isn't working like that every time. Every time. Let's get ready to take you into the service where God began to cause us to begin to blend the oil and cause the prophets to stir it with their own hands and prophesy miracles in this pot. And you need to get your oil. And in just a moment, we're going to collect those that have the $52 seed that may be walking tonight that need this oil. Stay tuned as we go to this here piece. Just a few days ago when the holy anointing oil appeared right here on this stage. That looks like a gum. It's like a gum. Oh, the glory. 